Hello everybody, um, pretty quick vid I wanted to make. Um, Captain Toad, they made a... They announced a DLC at the most recent Nintendo Direct, and I just wanted to cover the first level, because I hadn't really seen anybody else cover it yet, so... Why not? Um, like they said, it's... Well, I'll show it at the end of the video, the shop description, but... The video... No. The, um... What should I say? The DLC is coming out in, like, mid-March of next year. Also, as you can see, I do- I have not actually finished Captain Toad yet, I will get to the 100% walkthrough at some point, but not yet. Um, it'll come in a while. <laughs> and, yes, I do have the Nintendo Direct reaction, uh, I'll try and edit it soon, but... Yeah, as you can see, the DLC comes in a very gold book, the search for a legendary crown. And, uh, yeah, the first level they let you get immediately after playing the DLC is called Shifty Shrine. And yeah, and also something I mentioned, they said that there there's five new courses, only five, but there'd be 18 levels in total. So yeah, let's start now. Ready for adventure. Shifty Shrine. You go. Okay, so yeah, it, it's a pretty good looking level, kind of what you'd expect. Nothing really too unique about it, except for this, because the whole level just separates in two and you can walk across. And yeah. Um, I don't know, pretty good looking level, I guess, so watch out for that toad, and walk off the edge like a boss. Wow. <laughs> I'm really good at this game, as you can tell. So, yeah. Um, it's not, not really too much I can say, but for some reason they decided to make the diamonds blue or purplish in the DLC. I'm not sure that's actually related to the story of it at all or anything, but that's what we get. Also, I'm not sure what that little hole is about. Oh, <laughs> there's a diamond in there. I'm dumb. Okay. Um, yeah, but basically the first time I've actually tried to do this, I want to do this for more stuff in the future, but post commentary, just recording it and then doing the commentary afterward. So, yeah. I'm not sure why I even walked in there, because it's kind of a useless place to be, but <laughs> whatever. Some coins and stuff. I like how there's a little, like, caution tape on the edge of the red thing. Or maybe it's a shadow and I'm dumb. That's probably a shadow. <laughs> also, I missed the diamond. I'll, I actually go back and get that eventually, I swear. But, um, that's besides the point, so. Um, yeah, Captain Toad Trash Tracker is actually a really fun game. Like, to be honest, I'd almost expect more, I almost expected more of a sequel rather than a, um, I guess DLC. <laughs> like, to put DLC on a port of a Wii U game that came out, like, six months ago. <laughs> like, that's kind of random, but, yeah. Anyways, this key's a little bit complex because you need to go to that little bottom part, I guess. I don't know what to call it. And you just have to throw the key across with a little bit of speed because... If you're not moving while you throw a key, it doesn't go very far at all, so you have to, like, throw it. And I'm not sure how I got it to land where it did there, but you don't really question it, I guess. <laughs> um, as you can see, I kind of <laughs> had to think about it a little before I actually got it, because I'm not sure I could get it very easily. So yeah, open the key, open the key, open the door with the key, and you get a diamond. And that just... Because why not, I decided to leave it there because, because I was like, oh wait, I missed the second diamond, oh boy. So then I kind of quickly remembered where it was, because I, I had played, oops, <laughs> um, I had played this level, like, very quickly early on, um, earlier today. Um, and if, if I'm good, this video should be coming up the day I recorded it, which is, um, Thursday, so, yeah. And then get the third diamond, and go up to get the crown, and I was like, oh wait, that's not how you get the crown. I had to think about it, and I was like, hmm, what do you do? Oh yeah, you go down there. So you have to go to the little outcroppings, I guess, and land down there. And then you can climb the ladder, and you're good. So I wanted to make sure I didn't, there wasn't anything down there that was missing. And get the crown... now. So yeah, um... Pretty fun level, but yeah, so peel three posters. I need I don't even know how you peel posters. I don't know why they're giving me a quick tip now either when I'm playing docked, so why are they teaching me touch the touch screen? But yeah, so it 
pretty fun level. Like, hopefully the other ones are more fun. Like, from what they showed, it seems to be. So, yeah. Um, and also, it's a good thing they are, are improving the co-op. Because the co-op before was really bad. And now you have the option between the two, the two co-op modes, which is good. The pointer mode and the side-by-side -side mode. So, yeah. I'm gonna cut ahead to where I filled the eShop description. So, yeah. See you in a second. Okay, so we're back. Um, here's the beautiful pictures that I showed for the bundle. Um, not really much to note, I guess. <laughs> so, also, I don't know why they classified Shifty Shrine under its own thing, because you can't actually buy it by itself. I, like, I don't know why they did that. Um, so here's what the DLC thing is called. There's the image, looks nice. Um, the Captain Toad Trish Tracker, a special episode DLC, introduces 18 new challenges, including 5 brand new courses. Again, 18 new, 18 new challenges, 5 brand new courses. <laughs> like, I don't know why they said that twice, but I guess we ignore it. So, yeah, like, I guess we don't really know much what it looks like. Like, and also, well, I suppose besides the airship level and what I think was an underwater level, but... And here's what the individual level is. Captain Toad Trish Tracker special episode DLC introduces 18 new challenges, including 5 brand new courses. By purchasing the Captain Toad Treasure Tracker special episode DLC before March 14th on the eShop, you'll get early access to one of the levels, I think it said. Because, yeah, that's what happened. But <laughs> I don't know what it said. So, um, yeah. So, thanks to all of you guys for actually watching this video, if you're new. Um... If you're not new, I do plan on doing the 100% walkthroughs for this game in the next few months. Probably when I'm done with the, my current Let's Play. Um, and it will be no commentary, by the way. So yeah, thanks for watching. Um, if you enjoyed it, please share it. If you liked it, like it. If you didn't, dislike it. I'll see you later. Bye!